years ago, when I was an art collector, I hit the local museum to borrow a famous statue of Ma, the founder of Haven City. In his hands, the statue held the ruby key to the city, an artifact of surpassing beauty. And, of course, priceless worth, eh? Oh, I just love art. While smuggling the huge statue through the sewers, eh? A rainstorm flooded the whole place. The statue and five of my best men were swept away. That's terrible. Yes. A tragic loss. I've missed that statue ever since. The sewers have been so full of water and metalheads that I can't get anyone to go down there and retrieve the artifact. But you're special, Jack. You can do it. Jack! Hey, what am I, chop liver? Oh, don't I wish. Mm. Now go down there, drain the sewers, and find that statue at the bottom. Bring back the ruby key artifact, and it will open up doors beyond our wildest dreams, eh? Great. More mucking in the mud. I hate to burst your bathtub bubbles, baby, but that ain't just mud down there. Alright, so now we get to go in the sewers. Goody, goody! Alright, so uh, we are here. Uppercut! Yay! Let's just take out this car. Da 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 da. Explosion. Walk over all cool like. And now I'm stuck. Hop! Alright, so we got boxes just like before. This is not any p puny little arms guys anymore. Wait, are we supposed to be going this way now? Guess so. Oh yeah, that's right. No longer going that way. We're actually going up here. I always thought this was cool. It'll ride. Whoa! Whoa, it's so hard to see, it's so narrow. Not really that hard though, there's no technique to just ride it. And I can kick this, it'll lower the waters, and it'll open up another pa passageway down here. And then we can go around them and over here. Oh, almost landed on that one. I don't know how much I'll play. I have full health. Hooray. Or is it again? And now we need to go back down, I think. Right? Yep. So, let's find something to talk about. Anyone here excited for Heroes on the Move? I am a little. I'm definitely going to get PlayStation Move, and that'll probably be the game I get it with. It, like, when I saw the original trailer, it showed very little game, very little gameplay. And the gameplay did show the few milliseconds. Was it looked very stiff. So I was sort of like, I don't know if I want to get this. But their newest trailer, which was just filled with tons of gameplay, was um just made the game look so much better. I'm like, much more influenced by it now. Oh, with this again. Oh, now they broke. Uh, anywhere else we're supposed to go? Just checking. Nope, okay. And, like, bleh. I, like, I don't know if they ever announced the story of the game, but... I sort of figured out the whole story of the game just through the um trailer. If you look, there's like pieces of like it looks like ground all over the place in the trailer. 
So what I'm guessing is that a whole bunch of enemies will, like, a whole bunch of enemies have destroyed the planet and trying to, like, destroy all of the planets, I guess, that all, that they all live on. And they are all combining each other to save it. Now time for a cutscene over here. Got it. Where would you be without me, eh, Dax? Well, Jack, I probably wouldn't be two feet tall, fuzzy, and running around in a sewer without a pair of pants. God, I miss pants. So, Dax misses pants. Never t took a good look at this statue. But, at the same time, doesn't show the face well. So I guess it's time to get out of this place. There are no enemies at all. <gasps> ah! What the hell was that? Whoa. What the hell? Was that? I see like an orange thing like sort of poke out. I don't get what the hell that was. I think that was just the karma beast trying to kill me. Oh god, no. Okay, good. Bring me back up. So let's get out of this place. Get how shiny my hair looks. Wow. <laughs> I use two. I use two pounds of hair gel a day. So now we will go to the stadium. So we'll be right back. All right, so we are at the stadium. We destroyed Chris Cargo. Great! I'll send you a medal. Now, if you don't mind, I'm on a deadline. So screw Are you up. always this difficult? Let me handle this, Jack. Listen, lady, we beat your stupid course. And we can outrace anybody in this city. Wait, that voice. Now, there's just two things you need to know. One, we don't want to join your stinking race team. And two, you just lost a date with Orange Lightning. Let's go, Jack. Daxter, it is you. You're a... Oh, I never thought I'd be so glad to see your furry mug. And Jack, you look different. It's been a tough ride. The Baron pumped our boy here full of dark eco and did something to him. Now he's got super moves or something. And a few anger issues as well. I've been looking for you guys forever. And planning a way to get us back home. Somehow that rift took us far into the future. I've calculated the time displacement and you I found think your I've got father. It. Well, sort of. Working with the underground, fighting the Baron. But he's, uh, what? You need to go see him. And I need to get to the Baron. You could try to win the Class 1 Racing Championship. The winner of that big race always gets to meet the Baron in the palace. But you have to qualify by winning the lower class races. There's a Class 3 race starting soon. You can drive for my team. But Jack, we should think about getting out of here. I don't like this place. And some of the people are creepy. Jack, my boy. I need that for a key you found, eh? A special client has requested it. Sorry about that, crew. <laughs> I must have forgotten. Right. All right. Attention, all citizens. The class three race is about to. So we found out that Kira's in this game. We finally found her, and um, and I don't know how the hell crew fit through that door. I know this is a pretty big space, but I don't think he could fit through that. I don't even know how he could get that far without like somebody taking him down thinking he's an animal. 
now we get to race. Look at all this crap. Look at all these. Oh, I didn't mean to. I just want to stand on it. Look at all these sprite cheering people. Their sprites are flat. And I shoot them. Die! <laughs> die, sprites, die! If you don't know what a sprite is, it's pretty much like 8 bit Mario from the original Mario Kart is a sprite. But here is our car. Our, our motorcycle. So I actually go. I'm like totally forgetting the controls. But you can hop with. It. Now, if you. Aw, oh, damn it! Assholes in the way. If you boost it right there and then jump at the right time, you can have, shortcut it. But after you do it, it like triggers them into doing it so they can do it too. Oh god. One little mistake will screw you over in this. There's probably no way. I can. And don't try to hit the walls or get damaged too much because then. And if you still aren't dead by then, and you're still like damaged, you'll go like really slow, and there'll be like no possible way you're gonna win the race. So I don't even know why they added that. Controls are a lot weirder than I remember, and the CPUs are a lot more uh, butt faces than I remember. Whoa! If you feel like you're gonna miss something, slow down and take your time. Trust me, it's worth it better than exploding. So, with that jump, I went pretty much from last to first. And now we get to take this turn again. No speed boost. Oh no! Oh, I thought I was gonna make that. But you see, they took the shortcut too. So they're still right on my tail. Uh oh. Out of my way. Out, I said out of my way. Out. Hey, you're a butt face. Whoa. Oh god, oh god. Oh no! Okay, so I will cut out until I get it. I think I got it, guys. Yay! When is this city gonna provide some challenge, huh? Hey, I watched your race today. You were pretty amazing out there. Oh, thanks, uh, Kira. Uh, this is Ashlyn. She's just... Everyone knows who she is. And Kira's... A, a friend. A very good friend. Thanks for helping out with that tanker, Jack. You saved a lot of lives. I'm not my father, you know. Ever since I was a little girl, I've looked down at the city streets from that ridiculous palace and imagined a better place. By the way, they're hunting for you. I'd watch out for Errol. I can't protect you from him. Woo! She's a Betty! And she likes you, Jack! Not that I can account for her tastes. I bet you'd love to pin some medals on her chest, huh? <laughs> what? What'd I say? What did you say, Jack? Oh, got to Endeavor. I'm eating food. Soup. Which tastes good. I'm just gonna continue row jumping and spinning and uppercutting and spinning. And that'll be it for this part. I'll see you on another part of Let's Play Jack 2!